hot sauce again, guys. Good afternoon. I got one, another one that my mother-in-law sent me for my birthday. This is Dan's Prime. I've never heard of the brand before, but Widowmaker Habanero. Although they got the tilde over the N. <coughs> that hyper-foreignism that people love to do with the habanero. Uh, make it into habanero. I don't play that game, people. That's not phonetically correct. It's named after Habana or Havana, Cuba. It's not Havania or Habana. It's Habana. So, I do not say habanero. I say habanero. Ranting is done. <laughs> um, anyway, we're going to crack this bad boy open and see if it's as hot as it claims to be. It's a habanero-based sauce. Um, all natural ingredients shake well. Select red habanero peppers, fresh carrots, onions, lime juice, vinegar, garlic, and salt. That's it. Cool. Habanero's first ingredient. Fixing to be a little bit of a warm one, but we'll actually see. Oh, according to this, it expired August 24th. Whatevs. I'm down. Let's see, make sure there's no perforation. Oh, there is. Yet another limiting spout to be pitching. Almost smells like saffron type hints. Oh. Definitely got the carrot smell. I mean, I don't know if I can smell the lime juice. Definitely got little bits of, and p pieces of pulp in it. Still fairly thin, but approaching like a medium consistency. So, Dan's Prime Widowmaker. Take a look. Hmm. My savory faint hints of carrots. Got the onion going on in there too. Aftertaste got faint. Faint bit of uh, the lime <coughs> essence. <coughs> Excuse me. It's not, no, it's not that hot. This is actually a pretty mild one. That's surprising. Maybe I didn't shake it up well enough. Let's go back for another round, shall we? Yeah, kicked it up a little bit more. This is actually a really mild one. I wonder if they didn't use the ahi dulce peppers. Because <laughs> this is pretty mild. Select red habaneros. Ahi dulce varieties tend to be red. They look just like regular habaneros, basically, but with virtually no heat. Some of them actually don't have any. By the way, it's got a nice carrot, onion, lime fusion that really accents well the flavor of the habaneros but you can still taste the hab flavor that sweet faintly citrusy a uh, little bit musky type pepper flavor coming through and it adds a little bit of I got a nice little coal happening in the throat but again it's not that bad um, so yeah not a bad sauce at all that'd be great on a bit of beans and rice and maybe a little uh, cheese melted on top douse it in some of that 
Good stuff. Quick lunch. <laughs> All right. Dan's Prime Widowmaker. Thank you again, Pam, my mother-in-law, for sending me another awesome sauce. And thank you guys for watching. I will see you around. I'm going to have plenty more after this, so stay tuned. Bye-bye.